Today we are here in the Dominican Republic at a local high school putting on a workshop teaching 15 of the girls about photography, modeling, and the fashion industry. Kay Powers, the photographer for our shoot in the Dominican Republic, is really the catalyst behind this initiative. Her passions are very similar to mine in Sports Illustrated and about, you know, empowering women and girls to uh, realize their fullest potential. So we're here. The whole idea is that the images that women are seeing now, globally, especially in America, have changed. You know, body inclusivity, um, diversity, it's really an incredible moment in our industry. And we wanted to take what Sports Illustrated is doing in that aspect with their brand and sort of bring it to our shoot here. Expose these girls to this idea that definitions of beauty and femininity are changing. So what used to be the case was there weren't as many women involved. There were a lot of men in CEO positions affecting the way that imagery was created, the perceptions of what beauty is. So they decided that it was typically thin, tall, white, blonde women that would be on the cover of the magazine or representing the brand of the makeup that you would buy or the clothes that you would wear or the food that you would eat. It became a very important mission for us to make sure that women and men knew that beauty wasn't just one form and that it exists in every single skin tone, it exists, it exists in every single hair texture, it exists in every single height, weight, shape. We take some pictures, guys. You guys want to do that? You guys will each get a digital card that you can take, you know, as many pictures of, as you want of your friends in your group, and we'll be here to help you guys sort of talk through it and just sort of explore it and have fun. Yes. <laughs> Cute. I'll help you. I'll be with okay. you guys. So you guys are my group. I'll be with you, and then I'll be with you. Me too. You? Every single person here will have a different style, and that's great, that's a good thing. You know, that's what you want. So the girls have the cameras, and they've spread out over the school grounds, and they're doing portraits of each other, and it's absolutely darling, they're so excited. Um, we've taught them just a little bit of technical information, we're trying to answer questions if they want to know more, and we've set them free. Oh, so cute! <laughs> Inside? Yes. Yes. Very nice. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Wow. Oh, so good. Having something like this at my high school at this age would have been more eye-opening. I've seen them just in the few hours we've been working together evolve, you know, from you know, just taking pictures of each other standing in the parking lot to like seeking out shadows and textures. If these girls can walk away from today with one thing, it would just be that they feel more empowered in their own lives. I wanted to engage them in the conversation about diversity and the kind of imagery that we're all consuming on a daily basis through Instagram, social media, advertising. I just wanted to open up their minds to this idea that images are constructed by teams of people um, and that those teams have changed and now there are more and more women involved and I really do believe that the kind of imagery that we're creating changes the way young women feel about themselves. I saw myself in all of these girls and to see the smiles and to see the reaction was priceless. 